or was it a clear miscarriage of justice? The Vestal family says it already knows the answer to that one, and the proof is on videotape. Fox 40's Kenna Vernon explains. He's got a heart of gold. Frank and Joan Leone are looking at pictures in their Vestal home, remembering their son. But there is an image the family says they can't get out of their heads. This is YouTube video of the day their son Robert was arrested in Pennsylvania back in 2010. Is this America? I couldn't believe that he was still alive. The Leones say this is how it happened. Back in March 2010, Robert Leone was traveling from New York into Pennsylvania. He had taken prescription medication, which they say affected his judgment, but did not make him aggressive. Police signaled him to pull over, but he continued driving. He was finally stopped by Pennsylvania State Police in Tawanda. The Leone say the video shows their son being severely beaten by police, even though he was not violent. Here's a picture of Robert's mugshot. The Leone say the bruises in this picture prove it all. I could never see any justification in the damage that has been done to my son, both physically, mentally, and in his whole life, has been upset almost destroyed. Robert was charged with four misdemeanors, which include simple assault and resisting arrest. He's already served 27 months of the four-year prison sentence he was handed upon conviction. The Leones tell Fox 40 their son was unfairly prosecuted, and the facts need to be told. We need to have exposure. If the people are aware, then the people can make and demand and create a change. To make people aware, the family contacted a local watchdog and former Pennsylvania police officer, Larry Hohall. He put the video on YouTube about a week ago, and since then, it's gotten nearly 30,000 hits. I expected that to happen in about six months uh, of, of a lot of hard work, um, and uh, I just didn't didn't expect this type of reaction at all. When we contacted Pennsylvania State Police in Tawanda for reaction, they told us they cannot comment on pending litigation. The Leones say they have filed a civil suit alleging police brutality. In the meantime, they hope they can win an early release for their son, who is up for probation. Canavern Fox 40 News. And tomorrow we'll be hearing more from...